think Hodel senses something. Where does that drawbridge connect to? No idea, but I've seen it get lowered. It can't be lowered from this side anyway, so it's useless to us. It'll be a breeze. Get in, get, get out. Get the wind. You're Try here. this floor. I'll be saving this one. Well, we're on the home stretch oh, now. Don't take your eyes off the truck. I'm quite now. aware without you yeah. reminding me. This ends now! Consider yourself finished! Easy peasy, huh, Hoodle? So those are Dan and Astral Arts. Huh. Looks like it could be worth something. This equipment is really interesting. You must really like it, Alfin. Keep our eyes on the prize. Why bother fighting them? Because I certainly won't run away from a battle.
Who? 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 Of a lot of fish swimming around in this pond, huh? Are they edible? Sure, they're edible, but we've got no way to catch any. What's wrong? Nice work. What? Hey! Well? Talk about a spry old man. I can't wait to see him again. You really liked that apple pie, didn't you?
I hate camping out. Hey, that looks pretty good. Hmm. I guess even someone as fashionable as you wouldn't know a whole lot about Dan and Armor, right? Not really, no. Like, what's with that scarf? I don't remember that being with any of the armor we found back there. Oh, well, remember how you told me you thought I'd look good wearing some blue? I took your advice to heart, and decided to give it a go. Uh, oh, I see. Well, it suits you. Would you say I've learned to spruce things up like you suggested? I wouldn't go that far. That damn Ganabelt! I hate him! I'm not seeing very many enemies around. What's going on? They probably know we're not going to run away, and are waiting for us to show up. Well, if it's a fight they want, I'll be more than happy to give them one. They're probably inside the Ravel prison tower in the plaza. That's where the Lord here lives. The same building with the spirit vessel that's gathering all the light, huh? We need to be careful of how we go from here. The fact Ganabelt knew about my healing arts and had that poison ready tells me he's extremely dangerous. He's not dangerous. He's just a rat bastard who's getting what's coming to him. I'm telling you. Don't underestimate him. We don't know what else he's got in store for us. One misstep on our part is all it's going to take to give him what he wants. <sighs> You're right. Dad, what were you trying to tell me there at the end? I guess it'll have to stay unspoken and unheard. Like all the other things we never got round to telling each other. Mind if I join you, Law? Hey, Alfin. When do you find the time to train? 
What's brought this on all of a sudden? It's just, even without the Blazing Sword, you'd still be able to hold your own, right? But I never see you training. I'd hardly call it a regimen. Unless exchanging blows with Zoogles counts. I mean, sure, I get that real-life practice beats training any day. But you must have the odd trick or two up your sleeve. I just told you. I really don't. Wait, I've got it. It's your armor, right? You channel the extra weight into your strikes and... It's actually not as heavy as it looks. So not the armor, huh? In that case... <sighs> just calm down a little, would you? Why are you so fixated on this anyway? Well, because I want to make myself stronger. You're strong enough as it is. I almost feel sorry for those Renan soldiers. It's not enough. I need to keep working to get stronger. I won't allow myself to fail anyone again. Law? I'm useless the way I am now. If someone else dies because of me... Law! Uh, uh, sorry. Spiraling into self-doubt won't do me any favors. I know that. None of us are invincible, Law. We're all just getting by, doing the best we can. That's all we can ask of each other, right? It's as good a place as any to start, I guess. To start what? My new training regimen, of course. And what better way to kick it off than push-ups? One, two, three, four... <laughs> I admire your enthusiasm. Just don't overdo it, okay? Just wait. You'll see how strong I can get. See you guys tomorrow. Another gold. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Just a little travel-weary is all. Looking forward to finally getting out of here, you know? Still beating yourself up about your dad, aren't you? <sighs> I'd be lying if I said I wasn't. But that's not what I was just thinking about. Oh? I never did tell you how I ended up hanging around with the Snake Eyes, did I? Not properly. All I know is you had a falling out with your dad and ran away from home. Getting to Cislodia almost killed me. Once there, though, I actually ended up joining a resistance organization, believe it or not. Of course, before long, someone ratted us out. And we were ambushed by the Snake Eyes. I'd never seen such brutality. If I hadn't surrendered... Law? I don't know why. They let me live. They made me watch as they butchered my friends right in front of my eyes. I still have nightmares. I hear roars of Zoogles as my friends scream. The snow stained red with blood. And all the while, those bastards laughing. I thought that with Ganabel defeated, I'd be able to put it all behind me. Turns out that was a little optimistic. I was terrified they would kill me too. So I wound up betraying the memory of my friends and getting my old man killed in the process. I wonder if I'm any braver now. What if one day I panic again and end up running away like always? And leave us behind? You really think you'd do that? I hope not. But who's to say what I'm really capable of? Ah! I found you! Something wrong, Rinwell? How very perceptive of you! When I turned around, you were gone, so we came back to look for you. Maybe tell us next time you decide to stop? We need all our manpower to face these Zoogles. Jeez, okay. I can't help it when nature calls, can I? Nature? Ew, gross! Here? Let's make tracks, shall we? I hope he makes it through this. You invited him along. He's your liability. He's Zephyr's son, Shion. What was I supposed to do? Just leave him? Fine. Just don't come crying to me about it, all right? I've got enough deadbeats slowing me down as it is. <laughs> Why 
Why did people dig this path so far underground? Maybe it was too dangerous on the mountains for them to traverse over them. So you're saying that before Dana was conquered, Danans made this so that they'd have a way to get through the mountains? If I had to guess, they might have even lived inside of these once upon a time. Not like there's any way of knowing now. Not after all our history was lost. No, it wasn't lost. It was stolen from us by the Renans because they thought slaves didn't need it. And because keeping it around would have made it harder to control us. <laughs> it's not all gone. Look at that over there. What is it? It looks like a broken piece from a dish or something. Probably. It's true the Renans erase a lot of our history. But if we look hard enough, I think we'll find there's still plenty of it left. But first, we have to win the freedom to even look for it. We'll win it all right. Then we'll reclaim our history. I'm right behind you, Xion. I am. I guess Messiah is the first place we met. Hala. Yeah, I was a snake eye and you were a silver sword. Who would have thought we'd end up on the same team? You make an odd pair, it's true. You guys are the odd ones. Running with a Renin. Blazing sword okay? A little water's not going to hurt it. <sighs> Let's dispose of the trash. Ignite! He's dead! Burning! Lightning orb! Blast us shot! Ready to split! Your armor won't save you! Thank 
goodness, we won! it out there. Some power you wield. You're the one who did the heavy lifting. With your flames and my technique, we're stronger together than we are apart. Quite the gunslinger. I have to be in this world. Don't worry, I've got your back.
I found some equipment. Let me take a look at it. There's always room for improvement. This is barely target practice. Then why bother fighting them? Because I certainly won't run away from a battle. Walking up and down is a pain. Yeah, I wish we could just go straight through without all this hassle. On the other hand, the collapsed parts let you reach some places you wouldn't be able to otherwise. Now that you mention it, the ceiling's not gonna come down on us, is it? They were all that easy. Yeah, I think we might be getting too strong. Isn't that good? Play along, would you? I need something to eat.
I'm ready for the next battle. Used a bit too much healing. <sighs> With this, I can become even stronger. I try on something new. Hey, Law. Back when we left Sisladen, you remember how you said so long as you don't give up, there's nothing to stop someone starting over? Yeah? Well, I think you did just that. You've set out on a new path despite what happened in your past. Uh. Besides, you're not the only one fumbling your way through things. You too? It was your dad who taught me to fight. Back at the start of all this, I knew that so long as I followed him, I wouldn't end up straying. But it was also your dad who told me the importance of becoming my own master. Of searching out the answers within me. I always figured I would one day. But at the same time, I had so much more to learn. When he died, I suddenly found myself rudderless. Sure, our immediate goal is to defeat all the lords. But then what comes after that? There's no one left to point me in the right direction. It was then that I realized. No matter how much I fret about it, the only thing I can do is fight. Ren in brutality isn't going to right itself. So that's what I'm doing. Fighting. And in the meantime, I'll try to figure out my next move. Right now, that's about all I can do. And you really believe you got what it takes to win this? Against all the odds? Yes, I do. Or at least I want to. If I'm being completely honest, sometimes I'm not really sure whether I can or not. So what if we're still figuring stuff out? If we do it together, then we can support one another along the way. Is there anything so wrong with that? No, I don't think there is. I think I get it now. We may not know what we're capable of, but we have to try all the same. Having another one of your secret meetings? Don't tell me you were taking yet another bathroom break. Oh, we were just engaging in a bit of brotherly bonding. Isn't that right, Alfin? Yeah, that's right. Hmm? Fine then, suit yourselves. Hey, I think I can feel a breeze up ahead. I bet the exit is real close. Finally! Man, it's been too long since I felt the sun on my face. When I get in a tussle, I go full force right at him. Whoever makes the first move wins. I do have to admit, it's quite the spectacle to watch you charge in and go to town on someone during a battle. Yeah, it was actually my old man who taught me to fight that way. The more I lay the beat down on some baddies, 
the more fired up my fists of fury get. Zephyr taught you? Wow. I guess you really are following in his footsteps. There's nothing wrong with being so focused on offense, but the enemy always fights back at some point. Eh, as long as I don't get hit, it's not a problem, right? So what you're saying is you're too weak to take a hit. You're not exactly one to talk. What were you two talking about earlier? Earlier? Oh, it was just serious guy talk. You know, the kind that girls don't get to hear. Really? Don't mind him, Rinwell. It's just... Well, maybe it is a little difficult to talk about in front of women. Difficult to talk about? Okay, now I really want to hear it. Unless... It's not the creepy sort of guy talk, right? No! Okay, it's not creepy! Okay, okay. As long as you're fighting fit, you can talk about whatever you like. <laughs> 